first of all, I would congratulate Historical Royal Palace for having a diversity officer from the BAME. My role as an employment ambassador for the uh, Royal Palaces, it actually covers what I do for the community. Uh, I'm the London president of the Ahmadiyya Muslim Association of the United Kingdom. And in that role, I have to meet all the ethnic minorities within our community. And we give them career guidance, we give them, we deal with issues that people face daily. I then started to engage with him. He invited me to Hampton Court Palace and gave me a good presentation about what historical royal palaces does. We then started to engage with each other. What we found is that the Royal Palaces is one of the few organizations which is very forthcoming. And whenever you have employment opportunities, we get emails, we get letters, or if you have any events, and we, we send them to our members. And in addition, when we hold uh, any employment, affairs, etc., you're always there. So I work in the travel trade department and that involves me liaising with tour operators um, in this country and abroad. Um, and the role is essentially promoting the palaces to groups abroad and in this country as well and other departments across all of the palaces. I applied for the IT apprenticeship at Historic Royal Palaces because I found out about this role from an employment ambassador in the Nepalese community and I saw it as an opportunity to work in a prestigious organisation and because I've got the privilege to work in the same building as the Crown Jewels. Since working at Historic Royal Palaces, I believe my career opportunities have been opened. It's allowed me to work on unique projects that set me apart from competition when applying for jobs and also it's put me in good stead with, in regards to contacts. <laughs> yeah. I didn't feel like I was an intern. Um, I felt welcomed and, and respected by everybody. Even passing in the hallway, people would just nod and smile and ask me how I was getting on. So you feel, instantly you feel welcome and you feel part of this, um, this family, if you like. Also, I've been given a um, dedicated day to attend college to focus on my NVQ qualification. And also, I've been provided with mentoring to shape my career. The best thing working at Historic Royal Palaces is the fact that I get to meet and greet new people from all over the world. I decided to take part in uh, the placement at uh, Historic Royal Palaces to give me uh, sort of an insight into some of the work that you do in your interpretation department. Well, I did a degree in Arts and Events Management and the reason why I wanted to work at Historic Royal Palaces was because of the different events that they do. Before I didn't know that I could have an opportunity to work as a steward, they always try to mention other external opportunities around us. At Hampton Royal Palace I learnt uh, a lot about how audiences influence the way the interpretation is done because I did the front-end evaluation there. I had support from the HR team in regards to coaching and training sessions so that I could be ready for the role that I applied for. And because of that, I was able to fulfill it and gain confidence on the actual role itself. I got involved with Historic Royal Palaces in uh, 2010 when I um, worked as employment advisor for Twin Employment and Training. I referred our customers to the vacancies on the website. I think the initiatives uh, that are in place to increase the workforce in the palaces shows a real commitment that they want to have a workforce that reflects society. For Twin Employment and Training and Historic Royal Palaces, it was important to give everybody the same chance to apply for the jobs that are available on the website. One of the initiatives I did was to develop an online guide on how to apply for their vacancies, as well as on how to prepare for the interviews once they pass that initial stage. There is such a great atmosphere working here and it's like uh, being in a, it's like a family working t together. I think Historic Royal Palaces are really successful at creating a supportive environment um, because they have opportunities for staff to progress. Everyone is so supportive and I think it's a great organisation to work for. And I know from my own experience, I started here as a volunteer, just a three-month volunteer job and they, before I knew it, they'd offered me a full-time job, which was fantastic, you know, and I've, I've not looked back, it's, it's great. 
I would say to friends and family, which I have said already, work at the Tower, um, work at Historic Royal Palaces in general. My sister works here now because I told her to work here. Historic Royal Palace is such a lovely place. So I will recommend it to friends and family. It's a great environment and it's a lovely place to be at, so I definitely recommend it to all of them. I wouldn't hesitate to encourage friends and family to apply for jobs here. It's, it's as I said, the whole environment that they create and, and it's just phenomenal. You know, it's just a great place to work.